We are on the road to CES 2017, so get ready for some mind-blowing technology. Plus, we count down the top five trending stories of the week. This is BizWire TV, where your news is made. Now on Apple TV, iPhone, and Android devices, I'm Erin Aid. Top of the wire this week, the road to CES 2017. The future of tech will be on display at the annual Consumer Technology Show, which opens on January 5th in Las Vegas. This is the 50th anniversary of CES, and the Consumer Technology Association says this year will be more global than ever. Companies from more than 50 countries will be exhibiting their latest technologies and launching new products. For the sixth year, Eureka Park will be the Startup Central. 600 up-and-coming startups from around the world will be at the venue to show off their cutting-edge products, services, and prototypes. Letty will be there, ready to make waves with wearable designs to help you chill out. This is Relax. It's headgear that measures brain activity through sensors that don't have to be attached to the scalp. The French tech company says that users can see their alpha waves displayed live on an app, which can then guide them to achieve maximum relaxation. Rider will be at Eureka Park offering motorcyclists a safer, smarter ride. The Rider HUD is a heads-up display that clips onto a full-face helmet. The New Zealand startup says once it's connected to an app, it becomes an augmented reality device that delivers eye-level information about the bike, route, and much more. And mirror, mirror on the wall, show me the smartest reflection of them all. Millie Boo is unveiling the Echo Digital Mirror. It displays everything from news to weather to videos along with your reflection. The French furniture company says that the touchless mirror can be personalized to each connected user. Users can start up a favorite playlist while doing their makeup or have a timer pop up when kids brush their teeth. More from CES in just a moment, but first let's count down the top five trending business wire stories of the week according to our new V social media monitor. Coming in at number five, National Geographic and Katie Couric team up for the gender revolution. The best thing about being a girl is now I don't have to pretend to be a boy. Nat Geo announced that the two-hour documentary exploring gender identity will premiere February 6th and correspond with its January single-topic print issue. Number four is the lineup for the 2017 Essence Festival. Time revealed that Diana Ross and Mary J. Blige are among the star-studded headliners for next year's annual concert series in New Orleans. T-Mobile's free DirecTV promotion landed the number three spot. The carrier announced that any AT&T customer who switches their number to a T-Mobile plan and activates two or more lines will get a year of free DirecTV. At number two, the People's Choice Awards. The annual award show and CBS announced that comedian Joel McHale will host the ceremony airing January 18th. And the number one most shared business wire story of the week is Walmart. The retailer reached more than 30 million people when it announced that it will be closed at 6 p.m. on Christmas Eve to allow their workers to get home to their families. On to the launch pad where we check out new products and services announced on Business Wire. All of them will be debuting at this year's CES show. US-based AmazeFit is launching a full line of three fitness wearables. The AmazeFit Pace is a smartwatch with GPS and media storage, so you don't need to have your phone to get notifications or track steps and heart rate. The AmazeFit Arc analyzes sleep patterns and has a 20-day battery life, and the Equator and Moonbeam trackers are more fashion-forward in their design. Yee Technology will demonstrate two new products. The Seattle startup says it will fly the Arita Tricopter drone in the U.S. for the first time at CES. Yi teamed up with Atlas Dynamics to create the smart drone. It's controlled by an app and approaches speeds of up to 75 miles per hour with 40 minutes of flight time. And the Arita is equipped with Yi's 4K action camera that captures videos at 60 frames per second. And if you're tired of waiting for your smartphone or cordless drill to recharge, there's a new type of battery launching at the show that's promising to be faster and to be smarter than lithium-ion batteries. Zap & Go is introducing the Zap & Go carbon ion cell at CES. The Oxford England company says it's a non-flammable and recyclable supercapacitor which charges super fast, like five minutes or less. Yeah, that fast. It can power anything from cordless appliances to mobile electronics to electric vehicles. Zap & Go will be demonstrating the product in the smart home marketplace. 
Be sure to check out new episodes of BizWire TV and the Accelerator Report every Friday and Sunday on BizWireTV.com and now on Apple TV. And stay connected on our app for iPhones and Android devices. I'm Erin Aid, and I will see you next time on BizWire TV.